Hilchus Chirus Perik Achadoser. Mitzvah Sase Litein Schar Hasocher Bismanoi. Shnamar Biyoyme Titen Schore. Vim Icher Elacher Zmanoi. Ever Belesis. Shnamar Velisovi Olova Shemesh. Now these two psuk in Biyoyme Titen Schore and Velisovi Olova Shemesh is talking about a Schir Laila. Someone that worked at night, so the time to pay him is the day. He worked the whole night until the morning. So the time to pay him is in the day. So the mitzvah say is biyei metit nuschari. And Alder of Zed, there's a love of Elisovi Olav Hashem, the sun shouldn't set until he gets paid. And the Bagad Mishnah teaches you that according to the Rambam, this mitzvah say and Lesa said, don't only apply to a schir laila, they also apply to a schir yeim. They also apply to a schir yeim, that if you're a schir yeim, so you, there's a mitzvah say to pay him during the night, and there's a love of Elisolim, that there should, you, you, and notice this love also applies to a, to a, to a Schir Yeng, that this din of Elisavi Al Vashem, even though it's talking about a Schir Laila, also applies to a Schir Yeng. As we'll see in the Rambam, the Hemshech of the Rambam, not everybody agrees that, that both Sukkim apply, the Sukkim apply also to a Schir Yeng and to a Schir Laila. But I'll quote, that's Shittu Saram. Then the Rambam continues, Ve'in loikan alav zeh, even though there's a love, of him over in Ichra Lachar's man, the Aver Belaisa say, you don't get Malchus, Share Uchayev Lushalom. And the rule is that any love that you're over, which there's a Chiv Tashlumen by Hemshech, so there's no, a love and it's not Tashlumen, is ain't Lake and Olaf. Now the Shail is the Luchur, it's a love shame by Maisa. So what do you have to come on to the fact that it's a love and it's not Tashlumen, it's a love shame by Maisa? There's a, the Achreinim is this Kasha. And they still is to you and where you could be over with an, you could, you could be, make a maise in order to be over the Slav. And as the Mishnah the, the says, for example, in the case where the, the worker had a mashkin from the Balabas, and so while he has a mashkin, there's no iser of Lisol and Olav, or, or Lisov and Olav Hashem. The Lav is only when he doesn't have a mashkin. If he doesn't, if he has to get paid, but if he has a mashkin, there wouldn't be a Lav. So if the Balabas took away the mashkin, from this worker, and lapel he was over. So Mimela, so in such a case, he was over with a Maisa. Kopon, Al Kopon, the Rambam says, you don't get Malchus, and the reason you don't get Malchus is because it's a law of Shulchai Lishal. Now, Echot Zchar HaOdom, Ve'echot Zchar HaBehema, Ve'echot Zchar HaKelem, is Chayev Litten Bezmanis. So the Mitzvah Sase is not only if you worked, not only if you work, but also if you rented out a Behema, or if you rented out Kalim and he owes you money for the schar of the behemoth and the Kalim, and then Ichalachar's money, in the same way the lav, and Ichalachar's money, if he owes you money, if you owe money for Kalim or for a behemoth, as well as a person, is Aver Belesis. So the essence of the lav is not only for a person that worked, the says a schar hasacher, but also the, uh, for a behemoth that worked, and Alder is there for Kalim that worked. That's the. Then the Ram continues, Viger Teshov. Is also Yeshbei Biyei Metit Neschari. The Essa of Biyei Metit Neschari also belie, ab, applies to a Gerteshev if you owe a Gerteshev money. However, Vim Icher Ein Eva Balesa The Lav doesn't apply to a Lesa Said. Mashainkin the Essa does apply to a Lesa It's a Mishnah where we learn out from Sukkim that this Sonachamo. So there's a Din of Biyei Metit Neschari, which is an Essa. There's an, a, a Lav of Lisavi Olav Hashemesh. This S and this Lav applies Sai to Aschar Odom, Sai to Aschar Behem, Sai to Aschar Kalim, and I'll, the S and the Lav. And then there's also a Din that the S applies also to a Gerteshev, but the Lav doesn't apply to a Gerteshev. Halachic base. Kola Kevish Schar Socher, Kilu Notel Isnafshi Mimenu. Shinamar Ve'ela Vunesi Isnafshi. And Bepashtas, this Din, even though the Ram said before that there's an Isser of being Kevish Schar Socher, even but the pastors, this is referring to a person that a, the, a person that was a socher. That's the pasuk. In other words, he's waiting for it because he was working very hard for it. He was making efforts for it. So this din of is talking about dafka as of a person. Then the Ram continues. And when a person is kaver schar socher, he's over by arba zharz ve'esa. What's the arba zharz ve'esa? First of all, mishum baltashik, mishum baltigzil, and the mafarshim explained that this din mishum baltashik baltigzil is only if you're kaverish amenas not to pay. Because if a person is just postponing payment, so he wouldn't be able baltashik or baltigzil. 
Mashaing if a person intends not to pay, so he's able to baltashik or baltigzil. And also Mishum Li Sol and Pula Sakhir, which is the lav of Li Sol and Pula Sakhir, U Mishum Li Soviol of Hashemish, which is two lavim. Now the 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 pastors Li Sol and Pula Sakhir is talking about a skir laila. A schir yem rather. So a schir yem, so we're saying at least Saul that he shouldn't wait through the whole night. The Soviel of Hashem is just talking about a schir laila. So by Emerson Rashi, it seems to be saying that this is not talking about a schir yem, this is schir laila. But the Magad Mishnah points out that according to the Rambam, they're both going on both. In other words, there's two lav, and each one includes both, like we said before. So that the lav, the lav, side the lav of the soul, and side the lav of the soul, it goes side on a schir yem, and side on a schir laila. And also, Mishum biyem itit nschari. So someone, that's a kever schar socher. As someone that's a kever schar socher is ever in arba as horus and an essa. Lachur, you have to tzarech uh, ksas that if we assume that the first part of the halacha base called a kever schar socher is talking about benigaya only a, a, a schar socher mamish and not kelim and a behema, which lachur the pastors advarim. So then, lechur the hemshech advarim would be beeva be'arba as horus be'essa would also refer only to an odom. So lechur in, in the beginning in halacha alav the ram brings down this din of mitzvah sasei litn schar asachar bezmane and he brings the pasuk beemetit nschari he brings the pasuk of lisovi olav hashemesh and he writes clearly that it applies side to a odom side to a beemet side to kelu. Then the ram speaks about something which seems to be only for an odom that din of kilo natalis nafshei. And then the Rambam says this din that you're even on Arba as Horus and Anessa. So Lechura the Pashtus would be that it's going on all, all the places where there's an Azhar, like the Rambam said in the, in the first Allah, Sai Odom and Sai Kalim and Sai Behema. But Lechura, if it's coming Behemshel to Kol HaKevis Khar Sacher, and if we assume that Kol HaKevis Khar Sacher is only talking about an Odom, so Lechura, that would sound like that. That's also only talking about an Odom. You have to be Mavar. Then the Rambam continues. Ezu Huzmane, what's the dinner? You say you have to give Litan Schara Sacher Bizmane, and there's a lav of not giving Bizmane. What is Mane? Is Schir Yem is Geva Kalalaila. A Schir Yem, he worked during the day and he finishes at the end of the day. So the time Hagvi is all night. But all of them are for him that says, Le Solon Pula Sacher Itchad Baker. Don't wait until the night is over. Le Solon Sacher Itchad Baker is going on. A Schir Yem. A Schir Laila Geva Kalayem. For all of them, or for him, the pasuk says, "Biyemi titnus chare and leisavi alo hashemish." That's the din of a schir laila. That is the mitzvah sasei and the mitzvah sleisasei. And as we said before, that according to the Rambam, even though this pasuk is talking about a schir yem, this book is talking about a schir laila. But the pale is going on both. Now, schir shoy shol yem. You didn't work all day. You only worked some of the hours of the day. So then, geva kol When you finish working during the day, you 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 geva the rest of that day. If you didn't work all night, you only worked part of the night, is again, you were a worker for a whole week or for a whole month or for a whole year or for all for seven years. Schir Shavuot, seven years. Is If you finished working during the day, during the day, is gave a kolayim, this man to mon this money, is kolayim the rest of that day that you finished. Yatsbalaila, if you finish during the night, so then gave a kalaisa laila, so then you gave her all the the, the, the skiras that you your old kala laila. Allah gimu. Nasan talise la umma. Someone gave his talis to a craftsman, to a to a tailor to fix it. And Gomra, he finished the talis, but he dia and he notified the person, the bala talis, that he finished the talis, that he finished his work. Is a filu ikhare asari yomim. Even though the pale, the person that owned the talus was Ma'achar's ten days, he didn't go and pick up the talus and take give him the money. Is calls mansha kele biyad the woman ain't no ever. The love of the soul, these of the soul of Hashemish, these dinim don't apply if the kele that he gave him to work on is still biyad ha woman. However, not only bechatziayim, the woman gave it back to the original owner. He gave him back the talus during the day bechatziayim at midday. Once the sun sets, is even Mishum Lisol, because at that point in time there is a chil of Biyemi Titan Schare and Lisolin Lisolin and Mamela. So he if he's over, Shakablonus Keshidasu the Khaiblitin Bismani. So even though he's a Kablon, he's not a Sakhar, and the pastors of Biyemi Titan Schare, but so he's saying that Kablonus, Kablonus means when you get paid for the job. Schirus means when you get paid for the day. So the same dinam applied that Biyemi Titan Schare and Lisavi Allah Shamish. 
all these dinam apply also to a kablan, but only but nay that the item doesn't find itself bishus of the kablan if the the umma doesn't have the the the, the mashkin and the the keli. Halacha dalit. Ha'ima l'shluchei tzei uscher li pele. He he tells a shliach to go ahead and hire from me pele. Is that it? Im amal lehem scharchem al balavayist. The shliach said clearly to the pele that you're going to be paid by the balavayist, not by me. Ishneim einim evim shum tol. Zel officially socher. And even though the balavayist told the shliach to be socher. But since he wasn't the one that was actually secher them, so therefore he's not over on Baltolim. And all of the Zen, the Shliach, is Lefishayim Pulas and Atzli, even though he, he was the one that hired them and they weren't paid yet. But Lepel, they weren't working for him, they were working for the Balabais. That's talking about if the Schar was on the Balabais. The Inli Omelem, Schorchem Balabais, but if the Shliach didn't tell him Schorchem Balabais. So the Pashtas, the Shliach hired them, so the Schar is on the Shliach. So then it's a Shliach Eve, the Shliach is Eve. Eina seicher over now. Next halacha. Eina seicher. It's within the same halacha, but it's no halacha. Eina seicher over ele bizman she tovi hasocher. This din that you over on the soul and that by not paying is only bizman she tovi hasocher. If the socher mon by him the money, so then and he doesn't pay, so then v'le nosan le. That that's when he's over. Avul le tovi or but if he didn't mon by him, eshe tovi v'le hoyel le mayitn le or he was tevei. But he didn't have what to give him. Eishim choe tzalacher. He said, "Go to someone else. That person will pay you." And the kibel and the person that he owed the money to was mekabel. Is that So the love of lisolin lisavi elav hashemesh is only again if that person mun by him the money. If he mun by him the money and he had the money to give and he didn't give it. Mashainkin if he didn't mun, or if he mun and he didn't have the money, or if he mun and he told him to go to someone else and he accepted upon himself that he'll go to someone else. So then he's put it. Now, Lechura, this then is only talking about the love. The love, there's a love only if he mund and he didn't give it to him. Mashaying in the Essa of Biyemi, Titan Schare, the Pashto Sadvar, Biyemi, Titan Schare is an Essa. So that Essa, the Ram doesn't say that the Essa is only in a case where he mund. The Ram is only saying that the love is only in a case where he mund. You have to be aware whether or not this is Takazit. Halacha hey. Hamashe Schar Socher Adachar's money. Person didn't pay the schar socher and he was already masha adachers money. Is avol pisha kvar over beessa vilaisa. He was avos ayan the essa. He had an essa biemitit nuschari and he had a lisa of lisavi olav hashemesh and he was already over. He was already over on the essa and he was over on the lisa. Is hareze chay of lit miyad. V'chol e shiyasha is over a lav shel devreim shnemer al tema lereach aleich v'shuf. So the Ram, it seems to see from the Rambam that the S of Biyemi Titan Schari, that's the the Pashtas Halashan of the Rambam, Biyemi Titan Schari is only on the first day. Masha'inka, once the first day is over, o- over so the Khur, you could say there's a Chiv to pay him, you have a Chiv to pay him, Biyemi Titan Schari, pay him that day. But if you didn't pay him that day, so the Khur, the Chiv is still, is still going on. So it seems to be not like that. It seems to be the S of Biyemi Titan Schari and the Lav of Elisavel of Hashemesh. That you are over only on the first day. At this point in time, there's no more of the S and the love. Mashaink is a dindarabon. You know that you're supposed to give me out, that he's a high of litany out, because Lapel, you owe the person money. And if you don't pay the person money, so then you're Ava on a laugh shall the rain. Shinamar, I'll tame a lira chalech mashu. That's the khur of the mashmoy saram. Allah of Kol Sakhir Shasakri Baidim. He hired him, there were Aidim that saw the way the Balabais was rented, he hired the Socher, and the Tavei Bismane, and the Socher was Tevei from the Balabais Bismane to pay him. But Omer Balabais, Nasati Lechazcharcha, it's the end of the time, Nasati Lechazcharcha, and the Socher in Malina Talti Klum. So me is Meikr the Dina, since Ovid, on that day, we learned in the year, Schiris Batim, other Schiris, that we learned that over there, since Ovid, in the part of the Yem of the Mishlum Zimni, so it's normal for the Balabais to pay the Socher on the day that he has finished his work. And the, pale, the Balabais is tithing, I paid, and the Socher is tithing, I didn't get. So the Chur of the Pastors, Hametz Mechar Ve'er, all of Araya, the Balabais is Naman. But nevertheless, Tiknu Chachomim, Shi Yishova HaSocher B'Nekitas Chayfetz, V'Yitel, Kedin Kol Nishba V'Netl. That the Takonis Chachomim is that the Socher should swear and be a Nishba V'Netl. Why? Because the Balabais taught the pale of, 
So in other words, the Balabais is told the pale, so there's a swar to say that he's more making a mistake than the Sacher, and also the Sacher is the Chayl of Nesius Nafshe, so it's very negated to the Sacher, so therefore the Chacham instituted that the Sacher should be able to get it, even though L'chur Me'ikra the Dinim is such, L'chur Sadin, L'chur the Balabais is the Muzik, and the Sacher is the Meitzi, and it should be Naman, but nevertheless we say that this, the Chazal said that the Sacher could be a Nishba Meneik. Afilo Hoya has Sacher Cotton, had a Sacher Nishba Venetal, No, a Sacher means the person that hired him, person that hired him was a cotton, and lapel the sucker is tiny that he didn't get paid yet, and the sucker is tiny, the person that hired him saying that he did pay. So lapel, so normally you, you don't, you're not mighty from a cotton, but over here also, because since we're talking about a sucker, a sucker is entitled to get paid, and he's nishba venetal even from a cotton. That's the way the gears is, the gasimishna is the gears is. In other words, a cotton, which means the balabais was a cotton, as any a sucker nishba venetal. Now the Raven had the gears to Afilo Hoya Sacher cotton, Hari Asacher Nishba Venetal. It sounds like the Sacher was a cotton and the Sacher is Nishba Venetal. So the Raven is saying that a cotton is not, doesn't swear. That's why the Raven argued, because he, he, he understood that the Sacher, the worker, was a cotton and the worker is being Nishba Venetal. So on that, the Kasmishnah said that's not the right gear. So the gear says Hari Asacher cotton. In other words, the person that hired the worker was a cotton, and normally you don't take away from a cotton. So then, nevertheless, but over here, in the Tevis has Socher, the Chazal instituted that the Socher could be a Nishba Venetal even against a cotton, because it's the Tevis a cotton. Normally, to take away from a cotton, you don't take away from a cotton. But over here, if the din is going to be that the Socher can't be a Nishba Venetal, so then the cotton, which is the Socher, will never be able to get workers. Nobody will want to work for him because he'll tell you that I'm not going to be able to be a Nishba Venetal. So therefore, that's that's why the Chazal instituted that even if the Seicher, which is the work, the, the Balabas, was a cotton, so nevertheless the Seicher could be a Nishba Venetal from him. Now this Seicher Shleib, this is talking about that he was a Seicher Be'edim. He was a Seicher Be'edim, and he was Tove, so it's for sure he owed him the money. The question is if he paid him or not. So then we say that the Seicher could be a Nishba Venetal. Now, however, Seicher Shleib Be'edim, if the whole schirus was shleib edim, there's no edim that he never ever hired him and paid and work and, 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 as a worker. Is meteich sheyachal leima lehoi edvar meelam v'leis kar ticha. Since the balabas is able to say lahadam lehoi edvar meelam is naman leimus kar ticha v'nasati lechaschorcha. So mainly he's also believed to say that he did hire him, but he already paid him. And then the yeshava balabais heses shenasa. So then the balabais has to pay a heses. Hey, shuas atera. If he was made of mixes, we would have to pay a, 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 a swear she was made of mixes, kishara times. So again, if it's clear that there was a schiros, and the question is whether he paid him or not, so again, the ikra, the din, the bams, the din should be that the balabais is believed because I'm Yitzmich Haber al because he's tiny that he paid already. But Chazal instituted that this, the, the edem, that the, that the worker, the seicher, should be a nishba v'neitl. But when did the Chazal institute such a, such a din if the issue was only whether we paid him or not? But if there's an issue, the marshal, he could have tied that I bechlal never hired you. And Lepel is tying, I paid you. So Bechi Agav, the Chazal didn't institute that he should be a Nishba Venetal. So it's a regular din of a Teveya. If this person is a Muxik, is a Mela Mesim Chayir al Varaya, and if he was a Mesimachayir al Varaya, so he has to swear, Shwar de Rais. Vechain, just like we're, that, that's din number one. Vechain, him Tavi Achers Mani. If the din we said before that the socher is a nishba venetal is talking about if it's bizmane, at the end of the last day of the schiros, there's an issue whether he got paid or not. So we say that the socher is a nishba venetal. However, the chenim tovi achar zman, it was already after the zman, is afal pisha socher This He definitely was a socher and he definitely was owed to. And now the balabas is tiny, I already paid you. So again, the same din is hamaitsim chaver al so it's Hamitz Mechveir al Varai v'im lehevi raya. So then, as Yishava Balabais hasis, so Balabais swears hasis. Now hevi raya shetavi calls money. He tines to him. It's taka right now lachers money, but I'm the money you already calls money. There's the soccer is tining. I'm money you calls money. And you're pushing me off. Hevi raya shetavi calls money. So then he has it in as if we're dealing with his money. You know, this money the soccer is nemo with a nishba v'neit. Now, Lachar's money, he's not Neman. Then the Balabais is Neman to say, I paid. But if the Sakhar is tiny, that, that now is like Zmane, because I've been asking you since Zmane, you, you're pushing me off, and I have Adam to that effect. 
So that is so the din comes like as if it's money now. So therefore, I raise an issue of an apple called ACIM Shultvia, the whole Yem Shultvia, which is coming by Hamsha to the time that he was tobbing and he pushed them off, is considered like he's tobbing Bismani. Ketzar. The work was done on, on, on Yem Shani until the night. So when is Mani? Is Mani is called Leil Shlishi. The, the, the Zman is Monday night, Kol Leil Shlishi, night going into Tuesday. That's the Zmani. Now, Obiyem Shmini, Shlishi, and when it comes already on the third day, and he's coming on Tuesday, and he's coming to the Balabais and says he owes him the money, the Balabais says, I don't owe you the money, is any Nishbavi Nepal, because that's considered that he's not Tove Betel Zmani, or Biyem the Mishlum Zimni, but rather it's Lacher's money. However, it may be Adam. If this worker brings Adam, Shahoya Tiveya, Kolel Shlishi, all Monday night he was being Tiveya him. So then, as I reason, Nishbam and Etel, Kol Yem Shlishi. So then we look at Yem Shlishi as being the last day of this man, because Lepel, the last day of this man, he kept on mourning and, and not giving him. Memela, I reason, Nishbam and Etel, Kol Yem Shlishi. Abu Malil, Revia Vehila, Vahola, but Tuesday night, the night going into Wednesday, is then, as I may say, Bechabir al Varai. Bechenim, hey, the Adam, Shahoya Tiveya, Vehila, Chad Yem Chamishi. He brings Adam because he finished working Monday Monday evening. And Lepel, he has Adam that he's been mourning him till Thursday morning. Is that raised in this Bible? They call him Shechamisha. No, there's no there's no limit of how much he could bring Adam that he was kept up being Tevea. He could have been Tevea for a day. He could have been Tevea two days. He could have been Tevea from Monday night until Friday morning. So that's the din. So it's not normal. The din is that normally, when, when it's the day that it was Mishlam Zimni and there's Adam that he was a, a soicher. So then the din is that he is a nishba v'netel, if there's an argument, if he paid him or not. Masha'inkin, if there's no Adam that he was, a, that, he was a, that he was hired, or it's already after the yem the, the, after the time of the Gemara Schirus. So either way, the balabais is believed. However, if the worker brings Adam that he's been asking him a whole time, and Lepeli kept on postponing him, so then again, he has a schus of being a nishba v'netel. Halacha zayin. Now the argument is not whether he paid. The question is how much he owes him. I made up to pay you two. You, 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 you made up to pay me three. So the argument is how much they made up to pay. So over here, late tiknu chachomin she shava socher kan. Over here, there was no takonas chachom that the socher should be anish bavenetl on this argument. Ella, the din is the regular din. Amesim echaveir all over right. So it's a basically all over right. So the 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 the, the, the balabas is the muzik, and the socher is the mate. He's telling that he's old three. The mela mesim echaveir all over right. Vim lehevi right. Is avol pi shekvar nosim liashtayim isha omeli helech. So if he didn't bring a raya, so the chura there will be a svara to say that the balabas is a made of a mixtas. He's a made of a mixtas because lechel he's being made on shtayim and he's tying against shosh. But it, it no, the, 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 the worker is tying that he owes him three, and the Balabais is being made the two, so the Chudah Balabais is made the Bemiktas. But if Lepel, it's just right now he's tying three, and he's being made the two, so he's not going to make the Bemiktas. But let's say he already paid the two, or about the two, he said, hey, look. So Mel, he doesn't really have a din of a Shvua, so made the Bemiktas. So the Pashtus is that the Balabais has no Chir Shvua. So that's what you're saying. So there's no shvuas made of a mixas. Nevertheless, there's another takana. The balabais nevertheless has to swear by the kitas chayfens. And the dover is there. Takana is chacham. Mikdeshu liyelech has socher bepachan nefesh. The socher is like worker is like, and and he's tiny that he's old three. So Chazal instituted that the balabais should swear for him, even though be'am is shvuas has is not a shvuah. Of Ben Kitzes Chayfetz, a normal Kefir Hakel is not Ben Kitzes Chayfetz, but over here he has to swear Ben Kitzes Chayfetz. Now, by Medvar and Mamurim, when they're having this argument whether he paid him three or two, that he has to swear Ben Kitzes Chayfetz, the Balabais is Bishus Sakhri Be Adam. There's Adam that there was definitely a Schiras of a Veliyadu Kama Pasukli. They didn't know how much they made up, and Betavei Bezmane, and it was Tivei Bezmane. Now the argument is whether or not it was two or three. Avalim socher shlei beidim. If it was socher shlei beidim, so the MS, the balabas has a right to has ability to say I bechal never hired you. Eishet tovi achers money and he has an ability to say I bechal paid you already. So then there's no din that the balabais has to swear a shvuas mikitas chayfes. So now it goes back to the regular din. Yeshava balabais has to shlei kotzitz lei al mashik parnosin lei 
The Balabai swears that he didn't make up the pay him except, except what he gave him already. So then this special din, although there's a special din that when there's an argument between a sucker and a Balabais as to how much he owed him, so there's another din, a special extra din that the Balabais should be a Nishba bin Kitas Khaifitz. Now this din that a Balabais is Nishba bin Kitas Khaifitz is only on the condition that we're dealing that the sucker is mourning from him bismane, and also that there is aid him that he's a sucker. Now there's an argument. So if Lepel, there's an argument whether he paid him or not in such circumstances, the sucker is in Nishba bin Eitl. If there's no argument, if we paid him now, the argument is how much he owed him. So there's another takana that the, the balabayas is a Nishba bin Iftar. Masha'inkin, if these are, aren't the circumstances, or no, there's no Adem that he was a sucker, that, or there's no, or it's already after this man, so the Chiyagavna, so it's the regular din, the regular din is a Mesim Mechavir al Varaya, and Memele, the balabayas is only Nishba Shwas Hesus. Halacha Ches. Hanoisin talise l'umma. Someone gives his talis again to a tailor. And umma eimer shtayim katzatzli. You made up that you're going to pay me two for this job. For who eimer achas? I says, I'm only going to pay you one for this job. He doesn't say. Kol zman sh'a talis b'yad ha'umman. The umman has the talis in his possession. Is im yochol litein shehi l'kuche b'yad. If the umman is in a position. In other words, he's a din muzik. We'll learn the Hamshech and Tehim Venitin. He's in a din muzik. That the woman could tie it's his talus. In other words, if it's your dua that it was the talus of the balabas and lepel, the woman doesn't really have a chazaka, so you really can't tie it that it's his. But if it's in a situation where the woman could tie it, she'll kuche biyadi, so then the din is hariya woman nishba min kitzes chayvus venetel. So since he has possession of this talus, and he's tying, and he could have said, this is mine, and he's tying that he owes him money, so that's the din that the woman is a nishba venetel. And the Yochel litten b'scharat could be the man. How much could he mon? The value of the talus, and as, as much as the talus is worth, that's how, how much he could mon that he owes him. Because lepel, he has he has possession of this talus, and he's in the position to tie it that the talus is his. So that gives him the right to mon and to be a nishba v'neit. However, when yotzis talim etachas yode, the talus was yotzim etachas yode. Eish ein lehi b'chazoka. He doesn't have a chazaka because we know that it belonged to the original owner, and the rule is like we learned in the Nitin that a woman only chazaka. So then the din is So he's tining, the woman is tining that the person, the balatalis, owes him more, and he's tining, he does no more. If he doesn't bring a right, he shows a balatalis hesses. So the balatalis pays hesses if he has a din of a kefir hakil, a marshal. Because he, let's say, Halech, or he already paid the other one. Eshwas Hatelim, he do mixas, kidin kolatainas. Sheinza kidin asachar. This din of sachar doesn't apply. And over here, the issue whether or not he owes him more or less. So we said before that there was a special takana that the balabayas is nishba. He's a nishba with a mekitzes chayf. It doesn't apply to a sachar. And by a sachar, if there's an argument how much money he owes him, so the din is if the uman is a muzik. And he's in a position to keep the talis, so that gives him a right to tiny that he owes him the money, and he's in Nishba Venetel. Mashenka, that he's not a Muzik, so doesn't give him any rights, and therefore the Balabais is a Nishba Venetel, he's either a Shua Satere if there's a Maiden Mitzvah, or a Shua Sesses if he's not a Maiden Mitzvah. Halachetes, Socher Shebo Lihishava. A Socher that comes Lihishava, he's tiny that let's say you, you owe me money, and uh, you, paid, you didn't pay me. And, and the, the, the Balabai is the tiny guy did pay you, so the din is he's a Nishba Venetel. So the Sacher goes ahead and he's being a Nishba Venetel. So now, normally, when a person's a Nishba, there's a din, you could be Megalgal other Shwas. And as you're being a Nishba Venetel, but the Vaila, I want you to swear about other things. So the din is Sacher Shabali Shavar, a Machmid Nolov, you're not Machmir Anav. And the Amos is that there's another Indian. Normally, when a person's a Nishba Venetel, you don't first Matsya be a Nishba Venetel. First, you say, now listen, this person is tiny, he doesn't owe you the money. Now, if he's tiny, he knows the din, he says that I'm going to be a Nishba Venetel, so then he's a Nishba Venetel. But Lachatchila, you don't offer the Nishba Venetel. You, you, you offer that, you say that, listen, this person is tiny, he doesn't owe you money, so therefore you're not entitled to the money. But by a Socher, it's not like it. First of all, ain't Machmir no. You're not Machmir on you tell him right away that since you're a Socher, you're entitled to get the money. However, you have to be a Nishba. And also, the ain megalgon all of klal. You're not megalgon the shvua any shvuas. El nishba shalein notol v'itol. L'chol an nishboim ain makila. Normally, an nishba v'neitol you're not makil. 
In other words, you, 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 you don't go ahead and offer him to be a nishma v'neitl. Chutz men asachar, except for asachar, shemikil and alof, that you are mekel, upeschen l'tchile ba'amru le al tetzayir atzmecha yishav v'etul. Because you right away be matzia to him. Because over here, this person is tiny, you owe me money, this person is tiny, you don't owe me money. So if, if you, you don't want to be mekel to him, you say, listen, he's tiny, you don't owe me money. You're a moitzi. So now you have to like offer that he'll be a nishba v'neitl. I mean, you have to understand exactly what Knev is about it, and he doesn't know that he's a Nishba, he could be a Nishba Venetal. But you're not making on him, you're not Matsya to him that he should be a Nishba Venetal. Mashainkin by a Socher, there's a dinner, Poiskal and Tchilov Omril, Emule, Alta Tsair Asmacha, he shove him a tool. And I feel how you schari pruta achas, even we're dealing here with a schari of a pruta achas, Ubala by his aim and a satia. Is la yitl el of he only gets that money with a shwa. He has to be a Nishba Venetal, he doesn't get it without a shwa. He has to have a shvuah in order to receive that prutachas.